All right, that should do it. With that being said, save up one more time. And let's do this. I've been waiting for this one for a long time. Battle of the Eagle and Lion. I'm gonna have to fight my golden- So, this is to be our battlefield. Grander Field. Are you feeling confident, Professor? And this is exactly why Flane's gonna be our 10th member. This is the crew! Alright, this is the crew. I'm leaving Lysithia and Marianne out of this. Very. Excellent. That's most reassuring. You all should feel confident too. You're beasts right now. We can win. I'm sure of it. After all, it's not as though we've spent the last half year sitting idle. Yeah, and I can and I know one team like the back of my hand, so we got this. And I'm feeling stronger this moon. As though I could conquer a thousand opponents all on my own. Okay, talk your stuff, Dimitri. That's reassuring. You can depend on me. I hope you know that. I hope you know the same for me. Well, it's about time for the battle to begin. Everyone, brace yourselves. Let's do this, Blue Lions. <laughs> All I'm worried about is finding someone worthy to cross swords with. Go fight Leone. That, that ought to be an interesting match. We've prepared and trained a great deal. We should be fine, right? Absolutely. You're always so carefree, Mercy. Don't forget, we need to try our hardest out there so we can win. That's right. You two weren't even... <laughs> you weren't in the first uh, Battle of the Eagle and Lion I fought. I i don't think I've ever fought Mary... Um, Annette. Of course, I never fought Mary Ann, but yeah, Annette either. Mercedes I did for the first... Uh, the smaller battle. This is our chance to show how hard we've been working. Let's do our best. If I emerge victorious in the lauded Battle of the Eagle and Lion... The ladies are sure to take notice. I'll have to go into hiding. So, Vane, I gave you a lot of stuff, man. You better pull up. Ugh, what? is that all you think about? Yeah, actually, so long as you try your hardest, frame it however you like. Yeah, let him, let him do this for now, all right? <laughs> I shall give it my all. It feels like everyone's together now. No matter the battle, I will never falter. All right. You're counting on your guidance, Professor. Let's show the world what the blue lions are made of. Indeed. Let's go, team. You know, there's one thing that I am worried about. One particular individual. Because I had Leone before. So it was easy. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold up. No, 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 no. Units? Nah, no, 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 no. Yeah. All right. What? Well, why is Dimitri first? Well, okay. I'll let him. I'll let him have it. I'll let him have it. Probably because of the order. All right. To do. Then. Felix. Sylvain. Ash. Mercedes. Annette. Ingrid. And finally, Flame. All right. As far as our add-ons, I don't want Marianne or Lysithia in this battle at all. At all. So, Constance, I believe, well, actually, you can stick with me if you want. Um, but we should probably get Balt. Yeah, Baltus needs to go with somebody. Okay, then Baltus will beat me. Our support's at um, C, right? Yeah, so that'll be perfect. I got a C rank. Oh, yeah, of course I did. There's no need to get my ranks with Shamir. I'm gonna get them when I'm ready. So, Baltus. Okay. Then Happy. Who does have... It would be interesting if you went with Ash, I think. So, we'll do that. Not for support's sake, but just so... If you, he misses, they can't finish an enemy off. You back him up. Okay. Yep. Okay. Here's the big problem. Bernie. She was level 21. What the heck? Yo, y'all. This set recommended level 13. Okay. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's a problem. Dang. Okay. We only got one member. Oh, it's not a problem. 
Leone took it before, but with Ash here, the dude can go up and he can soak up that damage. Bernadette shouldn't be able to do much to him. So, all right, that'll be our first move. Ignatz, you and your archer gear, okay? And then here's the team. Okay, good news is Lawrence is on horseback. He sucks on horseback. So, we should be able to make quick work of him. Oh, I, I was about to say, just have Lysithia do it, but no, she's not here. Okay. The real threat, though. Leone. Are you as strong as you used to... Attack speed 17. You have an E in your bow rank? No. No, 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 no. Her bow prowess is level 3. That must only be for this battle. So, good news is Leone cannot use her bow. If that is... Then, okay, she got nerfed. Good. <laughs> good. I don't... If she was at her full power, we'd have a problem. Wrath. Oh, yeah. Easy. Magic unit. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I almost forgot. Dimitri, we need to reclass you, man. You gotta be equipped. We prepared for this. Another start? Another chance to grow. We gotta be looking... You gotta be looking, uh... In your fresh... New gear. Let's see. There we go. There we go. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. And on this. Okay. And yeah. And the threat on this side is Petra. She's still got her armor slayer. She's going to be tricky. Um, as far as Edelgard goes, last time I didn't even get a chance to fight her. She was taken down. Was it Ingrid? Is that what I think it is? Oh, and Edelgard's taking out units. Oh! Ingrid! Oh, come on, Ingrid. That was our kill. It's one of the blue lions. Um, so, not even worried about this. Like, the main goal... Yeah, they got Leone. Leone might go that way. Oh, boy, oh, that would be all too perfect. Okay. Um, Ash, can you reach? You can. Okay. I prefer you to do a send your gambit out right here. Um, as far as this side goes, we are gonna want some. Hmm. I think that'll be. Somewhat sufficient. You got Mercedes. Um. Okay, Annette. The dude, do you have a full? No, I want you to keep the shield. I was gonna give uh the dude the mock ring, or march ring. <laughs> keep thinking it's the mock ring. All right. I think we're good. Ash can get that chest. Um, and if not, you know I got the convoy with keys in it. I'm pretty sure, right? Yeah, we got two chest keys. Okay. Well, team, this ain't gonna be easy, but I believe in us. No one falls, okay? Let's do this. Oh, and Dimitri, I need you to fight both Claude and Edelgard this map. So, shoot. Okay, Leone, don't take her out. Don't do it. The battle of the eagle and lion is set to begin at long last. Everyone... Show off the results of your dedicated training. Indeed. We've been doing some training. Remember, we're not just fighting for honor. There's a prize at stake. Darn you, bro. It's almost time to begin. Steal yourselves, everyone. You all should know, I am not about to go easy on you today. Indeed. Remember that. As long as we can pull off the win, it doesn't matter how. Our victory must be absolute, no matter what it may take. 
Let's see how you do this time, Black Eagles. Because you lost terribly the last time. It is time. Forward, now! For honor! All right. And so it begins. Here we go, guys. Yeah. I remember. First up, we have to take care of Bernadetta. Watch Ignatz from the side. Oh yeah, Hilda too. She's got her short axe. And does Claude, he, he has to. If he doesn't have, yeah. Close counter. Okay. Let me make something perfectly clear, Blue Lions. Claude's mine. Or Dimitri's. No one else takes them. Same with Edelgard now that I'm thinking about it. But I don't, I literally don't know if we can reach her. Like, Leone will probably be this map's Ingrid. From, you know, the previous time. Alright. They're all marked up. So. What should I do? Well, the deal? He'll do four. So if he gets close. Make sure you got your iron axe equipped. Or do I want you to have... Speed doesn't matter, does it? Well, right now that's nine... Yeah, it, I don't think it really does. So, go for the silver. And your shield changes. I didn't realize that. Alright. Ingrid. Ooh, we got some Pegasus Knights over here. I meant to use Ash's ability. Okay, forget it. Oh, maybe not forget it. Uh, it's a little bit overkill right now. I get the feeling though. Where did Dimitri came down this side? So, I'll cut through. Dimitri, I want you to go this way to go to Claude. I'm head with you. Stay focused. Flane, you with me as well. All right, we'll want you near us. Thank you. Oh wait, we already have our. Are rank maxed. I'll go. Okay. Sylvain, I actually changed my mind. You, here we go. Mercedes and Annette, you stay close here over goes. here. We gotta wait for the dude to take out Bernadetta. Ready. Though, Ingrid, I might uh, have you do a mat dash. Ash, I want you close to intercept those Pegasus Knights when ready. All right. Oh, and she's going for Lawrence. Okay. Hit that to do. There you go. Ineffective. Okay. He moved. Black Eagles and Blue Lions are fighting. <laughs> Maybe we can sneak right past them. All right. So what you gonna do? Yep. All right. Come this way. Come this way, team. Oh, no. They're going for Edelgard. Yep. Yep. Okay. Leone's going that way. I won't get a chance to fight her. Oh, good. Let her do her thing. And I see you guys got your archers out on deck. I likes to see that, team. Remove Bernadetta. Okay. What are we looking like for... Attack is 30. And she's got a longbow. Okay. 
Can Ingrid reach? Let's do a test. Well, no, if Ingrid gets up there in the right position, she'll only have one unit to deal with. All right. 23 is your speed, Ingrid. Oh, yeah. I think if you get up there, you can take out Bernadetta. So let's see. Ash, can we make that happen? Five. Right now, her movement is six. Eleven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. No, that's not enough. Hmm. Now your defense is, or your protection is 13. Bernadetta shouldn't even target you, I'm thinking. I still want to give this a shot. So let's go for it, Ash. Alright. You saved me. Hmm. Sylvain, what's your defense? Your protection is 16. Is this just Ignatz? I don't know if we want to draw him in quite yet. And I think Claude's going to stay where he is. So. 13. Okay. Okay. Uh, Iron Axe or Silver Lance? Oh, don't you? Yeah, get that iron out. All right. What's next? Good. Now, go ahead and move out of the way. Dudu can take out this opponent next. Luck wasn't with you. Now, Bernadetta. Here's the problem. I can get Ingrid closer. So, ha, I was thinking we had Wart. I don't have Lysithia, darn it. <laughs> All right. Wait, what? Seriously? Why? Interesting. Bernadetta will change her target? Lawrence is going for this enemy right here. But... Dang, without Leone, this is hard! Uh... Hmm. First off, Annette, make sure you... Oh, yeah! Is that why? No, she'll still go for Annette even if she has wind. Well, Annette should be able to survive. We're just trying to get Ingrid up there. But maybe we should wait. Those who can handle it. I want to engage the Golden Deer. My protection is only 13, though. Dimitri, you'd be much better. So, Flane, you know what to do. Uh, one uh, square closer. Okay. Uh, Ignat's speed is what? 14, though. You need 11, and you can have that. Mm-hmm. What about Felix? Be great if I could put him in the trees. Does Ignatz have any poison or anything? Ah, shoot, I unmarked everyone. Okay. Um Hmm. 
What do we do here? Um, I don't know. Kind of stuck. So, just set up a perimeter, I think. If Ignatz decides to go up and help Lawrence, that's a problem. Draw him this way. Ah, shoot, I forgot I used this on a net. Okay. Well, first off, yeah, 1272. That's no problem. Thanks. Did I get more speed too? Dang, Annette! All right. Uh, I was gonna try that maneuver, but... Don't worry about it. Ingrid, you get over here. I don't want Bernadetta. I could have tried dismounting her now I'm thinking about it. Okay. I gotta be on my A game. I can't make mistakes like that. I'm fighting the golden deer at the moment after all. Okay. Okay, Ferdinand's coming through. Now where is Lawrence gonna go? Okay, we don't want to get caught off guard by the Pegasus Knights. A stronghold for me to seize. Splendid. Okay. There goes Lawrence acting on his own. Guess we've got no choice but to capture the Central Hill and cover it. Okay. So they're gonna change course? Lawrence, like I said, bro, you ain't that good on horseback. Oh! Shoot! Shoot! They're not moving according to plan! Uh, oh no! No! Leone, you're not supposed to come this way! What do I do? Golden Deer! Okay. Uh, well, we turn around. Uh, we ain't, we ain't ready for that. No, no, sir. No, sir. Ignatz, you were supposed to come for Dimitri. Okay. Lawrence. Come this way. Do you have a sword breaker? Yeah, you do. Okay. Mercedes. Nah, it's not gonna happen. We can't let them do whatever they please. Quite helpful. All right. Hmm. Flame, can you get uh, Ingrid from there? Like, uh, unmark. Is that Bernadetta's range? No. You're just outside. It is within Lawrence's range, but he doesn't even want Ingrid. Assist, rescue. That's it? What's her rescue depend on? Magic, but t ah, darn it, darn it. Okay, then that's a no go, Ingrid. But what happens when you move out of the way? Well, maybe we can uh, do another target for Ignatz. First off, though.
Ferdinand wants a piece. And honestly, Sylvain, I don't think you're a match for him. You're not. So, man, I'm gonna have you bail. The do? Ferdinand is now headed towards you, and he can double you. With the iron axe? 11, jeez Louise. You have Swordbreaker as well. All right, then no choice. No, 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 I don't wanna deal with those crit chances. To do? You wait right there. Bernadette is about to get swore. Oh no! Oh no, Leone! <sighs> um, I, geez, I'm actually very terrified fighting my old team. <laughs> they were stronger than I realized. No, I knew how strong they were. Okay. Ingrid, just kind of stay safe. We're not moving until we have a safe. Uh, we have a pathway forward. Sheesh. We can't do any of my fancy maneuvers because Flame's rescue isn't that great yet. Um, Ash? Oh, shoot. Actually, we're going to need... I wasn't thinking. All right, Burndetta. I think this is it. I don't even know if Ash is ready for this battle. And we're far. Whoa! Oh, that's right! That's right, yeah! The dude has a special! Not bad, Ignatz. Not bad. He lowered his attack. Hell is coming through to. Oh! Actually, Leone's not going to be able to make much progress without the Golden Deer backing her up. Lawrence is actually throwing them off. If they had like Scythia here, yo, I'd be, I'd be so scared. All right. Now these Pegasus Knights, they're no joke. Of course, Ferdinand would take Ash out. Okay. Hmm. Sylvain, can you you can escape? All right. I'm gonna deal with that in a second. Right now, we have our opening. Lawrence, you done goofed, man. Hmm. Who needs the levels? Well. Really, a lot of people do. Oh. Well, no. I think Annette can deal the most damage without... Whoa, what? Oh, you got a spear. That's right. Well, uh, Felix, how about you? Well, that's not going to be easy. All right. Then, Annette, you take care of it. We have Flane and Mer... Oh, wait. Mercedes is here. And it won't be that much better for her. Then, yeah. I think Annette's the best person. Annette, do what you got to do. There we go. Done is done. Nice. All right. One golden deer member down.
Is Hilda next? Hilda will take out Bernie. Okay. Uh, Dimitri? There's only one person I want fighting Hilda, though. Shoot. I forgot I was saving that for Ash. It's okay. Well, it looks like he can get away. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, that's not his range. That's yours. You'll take out Ash? What's your rain? Okay. Good news is Ash can actually run. Let them come to us. That gum, really? All right, to do. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's Hilda. That's Hilda. That's Hilda. That's Hilda. Unfortunately, the Pegasus Knight too. What's the Pegasus Knight's attack? Thirty-two. Yours is thirty-two as well. Uh, if you equip the shield, that'll just give you one more protection. Hold off on that to do. I kind of messed up. I wanted Ash to take out that Pegasus Knight and then Flame to rescue him. But I refuse. Alright. I'm going to draw Hilda to me. And let's see your stats. She might go for Bernadetta and ignore me. But... Resistance, huh? Your speed, you're normally pretty fast. 14. Okay. If I have the Leaven Sword. Whoa! What? Hold on, what? No, she won't. She's not. She's not. If I take my first L by Hilda, then so be it. Why? How did I not calculate that right? My attack speed is 16. Now, Felix should come for Hilda. Yep. Where did that speed come from? That kind of scared me. How's this gonna help? Lance Breaker! How can you double me, Hilda? Oh! She has Darting Blow! Okay. Alright, Hilda. Let's do this. Let's do this. Does anybody, um... No, I think the person who does, ironically, if Flame was closer, just like one bit closer, she could have done it. There's no way I can get Flame closer. Ingrid, what about you? No. We do have rallies. What's your rally do? Magic? Anyone else? No. Alright, you know what? That's fine. If Hilda takes me out... Much so be it. It'll be less likely that she'll go to Bernadetta then. Wait, Mercedes, because I I played this round terribly. Okay, I think Bernadetta moves first. Or if the Golden Deer go first, 
then we have a problem. But if the black eagles go first, I think it's a golden deer. Wait, no, 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 no. Hold on. Oh, no, wait, I don't need that chest key. Okay. We don't have to go in the trees. The Duke, can you take out Bernadetta? All right, that's three. I don't want you in Hilda's range. She'll change to you in a heartbeat. Okay. What about this? I don't want you doing that either. So what do I have you do? I think... I think you back up the deal. Aenots will want to fight you, but no one else. Leave Ferdinand to us. Okay. And Hilda's still on me. There's no way she should hit both of those. I should have done fortify. All right, next round, I'm taking my time. I can't be distracted just because I'm fighting the golden deer. My plan is flawless. Oh shoot! What? That shouldn't have happened. That should not have happened. Okay, Bernie took out Ignatz. Leone, you're literally in there with no backup. You realize that. Thank you. You're gonna die. Or well, not die, but like. We gotta talk about that after this battle's over. <laughs> Leone! Okay, well. At the very least, this battle's gonna be more even. Oh! 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 Wrath! Nice! I shouldn't be... He's on the enemy team. Oh, shoot! Oh, shoot! Hilda came through! Well, that's my girl. Ah! Here they go! Oh, no! Yeah! Yeah. Well, fine. Let them take out the Black Eagles. Oh, no! Now what? Hell is closing in on the do. <laughs> oh no! What do we do? Okay. Here's the thing, Ash. That gambit's not gonna do anything. Well, it might. Yo, I think I gotta use turn wheels. All right, if I don't, we're gonna lose horribly. Mercedes, you would be in their range. And Hilda said, yo, the dude, I want a piece. The dude would go for Petra. No, that's terrible. That's terrible. We, we're losing. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um. Right now, their speed is 19. Ash, if you switch to, like, the iron bow. Okay, they can't KO you. 
But the problem is... Hmm. Now they'll outspeed you. All right, Mercedes, I think you gotta go for that. Let's give it a go. This is not, this is not going well. Okay. It's not over yet. Now then. Flane, if you're right here, how far can you rescue? All right, we can work with that. This is our last rescue. And now you gotta make that count. All right, I must steal myself. Good. All right, Flame, do your thing. I'm as far as you can. Okay. Good. Now then. Yo, the golden deer are taking over. Hilda, go fight Petra. Go fight Petra. The dude, you can't you can't fight Hilda. You can't. I'm sorry, man. She's too strong. So that range is who? The Pegasus Knight? Also, Vayne, if you can get your battalion up, or your gambit, that's too risky. Get your uh, Iron Lance. Actually, what if you get your Iron Axe? No. Lance only. Though, if the Black Eagles start getting kills and you get a... Well, I made my move. Okay. Dimitri, we, we gotta go to Claude. He's vulnerable right now. And I'm gonna try to draw in Hilda. No. Forget Hilda, we gotta draw in this guy. Angrid, can you handle that? You got your Iron Lance. 23 speed, he's got a speed of nine with 33 attack. What happens if you dismount? You lose speed. We gotta start drawing them to us. Actually, Ingrid, I think I do want you to dismount. Cause there's a good chance they'll get on that ballista and they'll target you first, if that happens. Dang! You gotta be kidding me! Okay, Annette. Uh, Rally? Thank you. Okay. I'm gonna try to get closer to Hilda. Felix, don't need you. That's the end of our turn. Oh, Wrath might be in for some trouble. 
Shoot, he's 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 gone. Oh, actually. You're natural. Yeah, the Black Eagles are doing much better this round. But thankfully, they didn't. Oh, they didn't get a stat benefit. Okay, good. Held us within range now. And the golden deer are still fixated on that side. Ooh. Why did you go for Edelgard? Like, that's just a free kill. Oh, look what you get. Now, that was bogus. That was supposed to be Marianne, right? Marianne standing. Nice and good. Okay. All right. Hilda. You've been running the train on my team. Or trying to. What if I, uh, Levin Sword? It won't do that much to her. All right, I'll stall her here. Come here, Hilda. Now's our chance. All right. She's currently stalled, team. So you do what you gotta do. Doing my part. Good. All right. We also got a golden deer, or yeah, golden deer member here. Felix, you haven't gotten any action. If you want. Hmm. Okay, I stand corrected. Felix does need uh, his dexterity up. Another win. All right, Dimitri, you know where to go. As far as Edelgard's concerned, I don't think Edelgard's falling. We don't have to worry about that. Did do? Actually, no, 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 no. Petra's his worst enemy. She's got Armor Slayer. Do not go there. Instead, come back this way, Dudu. Um, Flane, I want you to start moving up. Mercedes, they can, he'll really, um, we will really need your, you over here on this side. Klaus still got some archers as well. Dimitri, can you, uh, 41. Ash, did you use all of your... No, you got one more. Okay, we might have to wait for Ash. Or to do. One of the two. Right now, Dimitri, just kind of stay there. Annette, get to healing. Thanks. All right. I'll do my best. Uh, Ingrid, you wait for a heal as well. And, Thanks. sure. Just chill. We need to take stock of the situation. As Edelgard goes on a rampage, she's getting closer to Claude. They all are. Oh, no! Well done. Actually, Edelgard's gonna be a big problem. If we're gonna do this. To 
stick to Sorry, the Hilda. Yeah. Each battle a chance to grow. You did good though. Well, that blood and sweat was worth it. Alright, good bought this. Follow the deal. If you're gonna do this, he's one short. Well, can you escape? You can. Alright, come to us to do. Mercedes is on her way. You saved me. And I think I'll come join you. Because there's a good chance Edelgard might. So what, I leave, I leave Claude to Dimitri? I don't have a choice. Unless we go for Edelgard first, which she is moving. So maybe that's not such a bad idea. Yeah, if Claude doesn't move, Dimitri, head this way instead. We're going for Edelgard first. Leave Claude alone. If he's not gonna attack us, then we should go, because Edelgard's getting too strong right now. Uh... Yeah. It's a shame I used Flame's rescues on petty stuff early. Alright. All right, now this is gonna go, well, it could go a couple of ways. The archers are gonna move, and if Edelgard takes them all out. <sighs> I ain't never seen you that good, Edelgard. Oh, poison. Wait, why us? We're trying to help you. Don't turn around, help Clyde. All right. So Casper's rocking 42 attack, 17 attack speed. I'm not gonna lie, that is pretty. Hmm. Mercedes can't reach yet. Okay, so what do we do? Well, Ingrid, if that archer is gone, okay, let's make something perfectly clear. Edelgard is not losing that fight. Linhart only has one more physic, though. Where's Ash? He can't reach. So that option is off the table for now. And Flane's out of rescue, so don't even try. Uh. Okay. Okay. Annette, try something. Try with me. Uh, take my Leban sword. Give me a rally. Thank you. Well, I could do that. But if I can't take you out in one shot. Mm -hmm. I don't have wind sweep. No. Uh, if I can't take him out in one shot, that's okay. Because Mercedes has my back. So, I need to get you with an iron sword. Casper still wants Felix in that case. So, let me make sure though. Does he have any. No. 
No, 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 no. I, I should be fine. My protection is 13. What's my HP at? Won't be fun, but I can take it. All right. I guess there's a little bit of, re of breathing room. Now, it actually would be kind of interesting, though, if Felix drew Casper. Ah, oh, but he can't. If he goes in those trees, then the other archer can reach. Whoa, you would one-shot Ingrid. Well, Ingrid, do you have a spot you can go in and take out that archer? No, because Claw's right here. Claw's right here. You do that, and we don't want Claw to get in the battle yet. And Petra's, thankfully, Petra's waiting. Okay. First off, Mercedes, before I forget. Well done. All right. Uh, what about the do? Well, clearly he's not going for him, so. What if you had an iron sword, Felix? 38? I think you take that, Felix. You said you wanted to cross swords with somebody, and that's not exactly that, but... All right, we gotta take out Casper. Dimitri, you give him uh, some support. Ingrid, just kind of chill. Ideally, we're going for Edelgard first. Ash is almost here. All right, that's the best uh, distribution for Felix. Now to do, uh, come over here, I think. All right. Yeah. Good. All right, nice, Felix. We've drawn in Casper. You'll be repaid. And that's the last heal Edelgard can get. So now she's isolated. And if that archer hits. Yes. Alright, good. Ooh, you went for Casper. Oh, thank you guys. Alright. Isolate Edelgard's attack area. All right. She's just outside of Claw's range, which is perfect. Felix, can you take him out? You can't. You can't, Felix. Darn it, Felix. All right. Claude is marked. Ash, you get close. Because we're about to make our final push. And we're going to go take out Edelgard. Um, I want to do where Felix is. Alright, Silver Sword up. Go for it, Felix. Oh, almost. Almost, Felix. Who can get the archer? Or, yeah, the archer. Hmm. How about a smash? Pink crit. There you go! Sylvie! Just give up. 
All right. Uh, Dimitri, why don't you get a little bit of a... Uh, little bit of a uh, poke before you go fight Edelgard, because, you, yeah, you'll need a sword. I must stay focused. All right. Edelgard awaits. She'll probably go first, huh? Okay. And everybody get in the right spot. Quite helpful. Because once we start, or once Ash does his uh, gambit, we go. Surround Dimitri as many people as possible. All right. Yeah. Good. Thank you, Claude. You're doing exactly what I wanted you to do. Okay. Unfortunately, though, here's the deal. We actually don't need 5114. 5114. Okay. 5118. Does she have any special abilities that we need to worry about? Hit plus 20? Why do you have that? Um, no. Oh, you, you also have an accuracy ring. Jeez. They really wanted to make sure Edelgard could hit this round. I understand. Okay. In her current position, how far can she move? One, two, three, four. Wait. Oh, yeah. One, two. The trees will block her way. She can't get in Claude's range. That's actually perfect. So what we're gonna do, we're not gonna use Ash for Edelgard. We need her, we need him for Claude. So as many people, you guys get as close as you possibly can. She might fall back to Linhart. If Lenhart gets involved, that will be a little bit tricky. And Ash, you'd be... We really need you. But she can't take on the entire... Yeah. Come for the smoke, Edelgard. Excellent. Claude will not fight. Alright, Dimitri. What can you do? Five. Well, that's expected. Uh, who has the best gambit? Well, actually, I think it's Dimitri. That's not gonna work. Okay, Dimitri, I know you got a combat art. All right, you're gonna have to go for that. We'll get you out. We got many methods of doing so. But you must do some damage. So, it is time to cross blades. I never imagined such a day would come to pass. Oh, really? That's ironic, Dimitri? If the Empire and the Kingdom go to war, we'll be able to fight as much as we please. Yo, Edelgard, what you- Edelgard! I'm sorry, but that is not something to joke about. Yeah! The thought of fighting you is troubling at best. That was that was low. In that case, I wonder when you'll be able to stomach facing me in battle. Do you need a few moments? I can't. Mm mm. Mm mm. Dimitri, put in word. <sighs> Though she's clearly much stronger than you right now. All right, my turn. Ruptured heaven. I saved it just for you. If you stand in my way, 
I will cut you down until you have no blood left to bleed. That's my line, Edelgard. You've never hit me before. What? I was just trying to rally your spirits. Yo! Now, to victory! What is with this joking tone I hear? <laughs> Alright. Edelgard down. Cool. We must all do our part. I'm sorry, but I must retreat. You should have no trouble winning. Don't give up. Right. Right. They totally got that. Ingrid, you mind moving Dimitri out of Linhart's way? And there we go. Claw, my man! I appreciate you waiting. I needed to hear those before. We have for Edelgard actually does declare war. Yeah. Thanks for that. She got jokes. This man is about to. He he went from Edelgard. I don't want to fight you to you know what. <sighs> Dimitri, I need to see what comes up next, man. Astralizes Gambit, so we can still get close to Claude. That's why Claude's not moving. He knows he has the high ground. If we try to approach him, we're the ones who will suffer, not him. Well, I mean, you can't take out everybody, but, you know. I'm not trying to have somebody do the noble sacrifice. This is one of those recordings where I keep checking my phone, because I want to make sure I have this. Ingrid, you're actually a good matchup for him, I think. Well. See what you can do. You only need to hit three of those. Nice try. I was about to say. Is that supposed to be a cult war? Well, that's fine. You did good work, Ingrid. Hmm. Okay, I hate to do it. Wait, didn't he have a... No, just silver. 82... 92. Go for that. All right. Now, once again, Petra's the last one standing. Um, Ash, for now, why don't you go get that chest? I think we'll go ahead and take care of Petra first. And then we'll circle back to Clyde. Actually, you know... Quite Both of th these people who I have quite a history with. <sighs> Can I handle Petra? I don't think so. I think she's too strong at the moment. Alright. Dimitri, go ahead and get a bit closer. I'd use the, um... What is it? The... All on me command, but it's kind of risky at this moment. We probably want to try to use those trees. Flame didn't fire a single shot, did she? Oh, yeah, Ingrid might be a good uh, contender as well. well. We'll see. Just have everybody here. We're going to need it. Okay, Ingrid, ooh, you can't reach? Okay, let her get a bit closer. Ash, you get the chest. Killer Lance. Meh. So then you get here. 
as I want Dimitri here. Oh, jeez. Ingrid, she could crit you. Yep. Good old Petra. Still a big of a threat as ever. Here's the thing. If I use this on Petra... What would I be able to use for Claude? But she's a threat, darn it! I can't use Claude's own battalion against him. It's time. And I use this on Petra during our final battle. Alright, Ingrid, you should be able to now. Uh, make sure it's a hit. Oh, her crests! Whoa! Seems I prevailed. All right. Options? Uh, no, no, no. Um. Uh, unite. Around Dimitri, everyone. Oh, you're going against me? To me? Okay. Well, we'll do that again. Okay. Once more. You know, the enemy phase and the player phase, they match up. The red enemies is Edelgard. The gold is Claude. It's even a, a bigger sign, I think, that the blue lions is the cannon route. Because the player phase is blue. And normally, and traditionally in Fire Emblem, your units are blue. Heck, the main characters normally have blue hair. So. But it is interesting that green hair is such a big deal in this game. Why do I feel like I did that faster? Alright. Claude's got a longbow equipped. The best way, I think, is right here. There are less trees this way. And once again, I want Dimitri and myself to make our way through. But the dude would also be a good con uh, contender. Uh, Ingrid's just a beast. Uh, go ahead and heal the dude. Thank you. Lane. Oh, finally, she got C authority. Well, that'll come in handy in the next battle. Claw, you really not gonna move, man? You make our lives a lot easier. No. He's too smart for that. Alright. Then, um. Ash, remind me. Your gambit. Okay. Do do do. To do you get here. Mercedes, you here. Annette, you get to the bow. Hmm. All right, and Sylvain, I guess you just try to, you stay out of the way. You're no match for Claude. All right. Now see, if I do that, the do can't reach. Do I want that? Let's give it a shot. 
Because even with his movement... Mm, yeah, he could reach if he had more space. Could Mercedes? Four. Four. Mm. Oh yeah, she'd be in attacking range. Alright, let's just try. Either way... All right, let this be our last turn. Yeah! Dimitri, you gotta try again, bit bro. 35? Claude? Claude, what? I should have saved his, I should have saved, I should have saved it. I gotta go first. Claude! You, you realize, man, you know what you're doing? My team can't be doing this. You and Hilda. All right. You ready, bro? On guard. This is a great chance for me to find out if the sword of the creator really is all it's cracked up to be. Well, unfortunately, I can't use it against you, man. You're, I'm not good enough yet. On that note, you better not surrender too quickly. <laughs> Same to you! Come on! Alright. Team, you guys gotta get in there now. Who can do something? Well, Dimitri? Oh, wait a minute. Tempest? Silver, can you go with the iron tip? Dimitri, do I do this? Do we do this, man? Can you hit that? I've never seen a 98 miss. Take care of it, Dimitri. Hey, your royalness. If you promise to let me have the prize, I'll let you take the honor of victory. Do we have a deal? Enough of your foolishness. I... Wait a moment. You are trying to anger me, is that it? <laughs> Saw right through me, did you? Well, if there's no deal, I'll just have to win this thing fair and square. Come on, Dimitri! I will happily face you, here and now. Do not hold back, Claude. Now that's a... that's a... A friendly rivalry. Yeah! There you go! Alright. <sighs> nice. I will get stronger yet. Nice. I hate to say it, but it seems we're at a stalemate. Looks like the Golden Deer won't be winning this round. He guys put up a good fight, man. That is the end of this year's Battle of the Eagle and Lion. And the winners are the Blue Lions. All right. We won. And judging by our performance, I'm certain we have earned the prize as well. Oh, I couldn't actually tell if we took out enough enemies, but I'll take your word for it. All right. That was hard. Yo, the golden deer. The golden deer. <laughs> and Leonie wasn't even a problem. She just went and started taking everybody out before they got the buff. And she didn't have her bow either. Okay. I'm not going to admit. I'll, I'll, I'm not going to lie. I was sweating. I was seriously sweating. Well done, your princeliness. I'm certainly not in any hurry to get on your bad side. Well, we'll see what happens in the future, Claude. I assumed you would attack us head on. Well, what did we do? No, <laughs> well, I tried, but then Lawrence came, then held the cave, and then... <sighs> I clearly need to rethink my opinion of you. Well done, Dimitri. You both deserve equal praise for a battle well fought. All three houses did extremely well. Yeah, this time, the Black Eagles and the Golden Deer were quite the opponents. Though I do have to give... I don't think I'm being biased in saying this. I gotta give a slight edge to the Golden Deer. Because they gave me... They gave me a lot of trouble. Don't you agree, Professor? You know what? Hey, but if, if we gonna say in this case, alright, I have an option... Like, you can't blame me, guys. I gotta go. Golden Deer was strong. <laughs> it's an honor to hear that from a fighter such as yourself. But there's no getting around it. 
the Blue Lions were better prepared. But I'm still proud of you guys, man. In any case, I hope the day never comes when we have to put this experience to use. Did you say that last time? I think you jinxed it, Claude. I wouldn't mind. I'll accept a challenge from either of you at any time. <laughs> I'm kidding, of course. I can't laugh at that, Edelgard. I, I really, really can't. Because of your actions, so many people from your house had to fall. We could have been allies! I don't understand why you had to take over the other nations. That is nothing to joke about. The true battle of the eagle and lion is best left in the past. I agree, Dimitri. In fact, I wouldn't be surprised if they eventually change the name of this mock battle. I hope so. How admirable, Teach. On that note, I have a proposition. Oh, Claude is the one who gives the proposition every time. When we get back to Garrick Mach, let's have a grand feast to break down the walls between our respective houses. No, 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 no. Without a doubt, 110%, Claude's the neutral guy in this conflict. Like, it's the battle of the eagle and lion. Claude's like, hey, let's have a feast. Let's not fight, guys. Let's make peace instead. And by a grand feast, I mean a fairly regular feast in the dining hall. You really value that kind of thing, don't you? <laughs> well, I suppose no harm can come from it. Count me in. Like, don't forget... <sighs> I have no objections either. And you, Professor? <sighs> I'm looking forward to it. You look so... happy. I love seeing you like this. Oh well, yeah? I feel pretty good right now. I suppose that look on your face is just another boon from this glorious day. Perhaps the best one of all. Man, oh man. And now it is time for the question of the day. And this battle was... Wow. Wow. Like, already, I was expecting it to be quite an experience. This is the first time I'm fighting, like, the full might of the Golden Deer. But keep in mind, Marianne and Lysithia weren't there. So imagine if Lysithia had been there instead of, and Marianne, instead of that, the one um, mage who attacked Edelgard and then gave them a boost. Like that was, like why would they, why would she do that? <laughs> like that made things a lot harder for them. But anyways, versus Marianne who ended up taking out Felix in my route. But to see them and them be the biggest threat, at least in my book, uh, because I, I think it's because I didn't take out Bernadetta quickly enough. And not having Leone hurt more than I realized. Uh, and yeah, her, her performance wasn't as spectacular, but she didn't have her bow. That's one of the most deadly things about her. But uh, yeah, not taking out Bernadetta. So then the Golden Deer swooped in and started getting the buffs. And then it's like, oh, shoot. <laughs> I'm in trouble now. And then the Black Eagles. Unlike last time, which they had a lackluster performance besides Petra, I would say, they actually came through and we were able to get Dimitri able to fight Edelgard and Claude. In case you're wondering why I give the advantage to the Golden Deer, not the Black Eagles, who you could see there were moments where they were putting pressure on me, that's because for one simple reason. The Black Eagles, no matter how it looked, were always acting how I felt they would act according to plan the golden deer did not and when they didn't they really didn't and it paid off for them and it was also in the early game the later the game goes on the more i'm able to have control of my units you know they're more together and we can group up and take out the enemy systematically but at the beginning of the battle i kind of needed to spread them out and the golden deer prevented me from capitalizing on that now, don't get me wrong, the Black Eagles performed very good as well. And the Golden Deer had some units that made very terrible mistakes. But I definitely would say that for me, for the person actually playing, you know, with all the strategies I had, they made the map harder for me. More than the Black Eagles did, despite how it might have looked. And I gotta say, this episode really confirmed, I think, the, that Claude and the Golden Deer are supposed to be the neutral category. And I feel, well, I, I think it's still too early for me to say if Dimitri and the Blue Lions are supposed to be like the protagonists, but uh, definitely 
seeing how the three colors matched up. An interesting thing to note is, and whenever I fought uh, this type of battle, Edelgard and the Black Eagles are always on the right side, you know? Uh, and I imagine maybe Claude will be always on the left side. We'll see. Um, if that's the case, then yeah, I definitely think that's uh, even more of a, uh, a sign. But. And then there's what Edelgard said to Dimitri. Like I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be straight up. That's a villain line. Like, I when I when I'm honest with myself, the only reason I'm giving Edelgard so much uh, slack is because I know she has a huge fan base, and that there are people who you know that I know of, and they really like her character. So for but for me, it's like. Uh, I don't really have, there's not been a single thing I can think of that, again, I'm still going to give her props, I'm just saying, as of right now, to say what she said to Dimitri, knowing what happened in the past, and knowing Dimitri's response to it, is like, nah, nah, it's almost like she was enjoying what's going to happen in the future to a degree. I don't know. I'm not gonna say that, I'm just saying what my thoughts are currently, and I think that's a fair thing to say. Like, come on, come on! Now, if I can't even say that, then I think we got a problem. After all, it was a joke, as she said it, you know, like she said, she was only kidding. And, you know, we saw Claude's joke, Claude, and I think, yeah, to even uh, highlight on that, Claude's joke was like, hey, Dimitri, you know, it, uh, I'll give up and you can have the prize, it almost makes me wonder, like, because in the future, again, from the Golden Deer route, Claude's like, Dimitri, I, I kind of wanted to join up with you. It's like, we, I don't want to fight you, man. So I can't help, especially when you go to the ending of uh, the episode where Claude is talking to the two of them. And I thought since whoever the main character was, they would be the one to suggest a feast. But no, it seems like it's always Claude. So... I definitely feel like I, I picked the leader that I saw. I picked the man I wanted to go through who had my mentality, wanted to make peace, but that wasn't an option. I'm talking a lot about this, but yeah, there were on top of the battle, I got to see the leaders talk to each and every one of them. Because when I think about it, Edelgard was taken out by the Blue Lions before I even got near her. So I didn't even see what she says to Claude. Who, that would be in, another interesting but maybe she says something similar to him so uh, I'll definitely try to figure that out when I do her route but there was a lot in this episode and a lot to talk about with all that said it brings us to the question of the day if you're still here I wanted to ask you all who do you think was the MVP in the Black Eagles and the Golden Deer? And if you want to add it, the Blue Lions, aside from the leaders and Byleth slash Blake. Because obviously, you know, the leaders, they have inflated stats, I'd imagine. And they're supposed to show off. Like, well, again, except for Dimitri. Dimitri is kind of struggling, but, you know, it wasn't, it wasn't fair. It wasn't fair. All right. Dimitri would normally be stronger than that if he was an enemy. Uh, yeah, I'm curious to see who you all would give the MVP award to. So with that said, please post your thoughts down in the comments below about this, this experience. And I will see you all next time.